Human beings have been using speech and language for 100,000 years, we're told. And I'm going to guess that for 100,000 of those years, somebody's been listening in. Well, the people listening in now and watching and tracking and following are people like Mark Zuckerberg. Now, uh, what we need to figure out is how to make it stop. Zuckerberg is telling us that what is needed is a rebuilding of trust. Well, he's got a long way to go, and I, personally, I don't think with me, he's ever going to get there. He was asked uh, on CNN, can people trust Facebook? Here was his answer. So, any answer that begins with so, I worry, but okay. So one of the most important things I need to, I think we need to do here is to make sure we tell everybody whose data was affected by one of these rogue apps, right? No, Mark, wrong. One of the most important things we need to do is change your business model, break up your company or nationalize it and run this system right. See, Zuckerberg didn't even answer the question. He ducked the question and catch that use of rogue apps. He's saying, oh yeah, somebody went wrong and stole your data. No, that's the business model. That's the whole point of the conversation we just had with Yasha Levine. Facebook makes money by selling that data and not paying attention to what is done with that data. That's what they exist. Zuckerberg went on to say, and we're going to do that. We're going to build a tool where anyone can go and see if their data was a part of this. This meaning Cambridge Analytica, not all the other quote unquote rogue apps that are actually doing exactly what Mark Zuckerberg wants them to do. Now, he also said, you know, there was this Cambridge researcher, uh, Cambridge University, Alexander Kogan, who shared the data with uh, Cambridge Analytica, and uh, he said that Cambridge Analytica's potential failure to delete the data when it was asked to, quote, is a breach of trust between Kogan, Cambridge Analytica, and Facebook. Hmm. Cambridge Analytica and Facebook. It was also a breach of trust between Facebook and the people who share their data with us and expect us to protect it. We need to fix that. Now, Senator Ed Markey, to his credit, said, quote, you need to come to Congress, addressing Zuckerberg, and testify to this under oath. And of course, Senator Markey is absolutely right. But it's not just a matter of testimony. It's a matter of solutions. It's a matter of not living in an economy where someone can become a billionaire uh, working off technology invented by and developed by uh, the people at taxpayer expense with a few tweaks. And I got to tell you, Facebook still doesn't have a great interface. Uh, we need to really reform the internet from the bottom up and we should hold them to it.